Hello, Kara. You're here. Good to see you. I came as soon as you texted me. Did the messenger bird not get very far? Ha ha ha, funny. I may be 900 years old, but I still know how to use an iPhone. Is it another cat night? Yes, but there's something else I've got to do tonight. Follow me. Okay. So, where are you taking me? I'm going to show you how I maintain my immortality. I thought your curse kept you alive all these years. No. Believe me, a big part of me doesn't want to show you this. But like you told me before, I need to take a chance with you, Kara. Well, you do, Balthasar. And I appreciate you for including me. You cute little kitty. Don't ever do that again. So, what's down there? A spell book? A powerful artifact? <sighs> no, but boy, I wish it was that easy. <laughs> What was that? It's a part of the ritual. The ritual to keep you immortal? Exactly. And what happens if you don't do the ritual? I wither away in a pile of dust and my soul is lost forever. Really? Wow. Well, I guess we better get started to... started then. What do you do first? In order for me to stay alive for another year, I need to drain the life force of another person. It has to be completed before the second month of the autumn season. But I cannot drain them in my human form. I need to be in my werecat form in order for the ritual to work. A person? I hope you don't mean me. Was that your plan from the start? To drain my life force? No, 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 Kara. Kara, of course not. I love you. But I do need another person. That's where this guy comes in. Okay... Uh, I'm not so sure I'm comfortable with this part. Is that a person in there? <sighs> I knew you might have been. Yes, it's a criminal. I stalked him last night. But don't worry. Don't worry. Nobody saw me. Besides, he's a three-time rapist. Nobody's going to mourn for this miscreant. Balthazar, you know I love you. But killing somebody to keep you alive is not something I'm really comfortable with. Criminal or no criminal? I have to, Kara. I have no choice. Well, isn't there something else you could drain the life force out of? Maybe an old dog or an ugly lizard or something? No, Kara. It has to be a human. If a werecat tries to absorb the life force of another animal, it will not work. Believe me, I've seen other werecats on their last leg try on a deer, and it didn't work. I need to start the ritual soon. What about someone that's already dead? Maybe a cadaver, or maybe in the hospital? No, listen to yourself. I can't absorb life force from dead bodies. It has to be living. It's life force I need, not death force. You think I like doing this? You think I like having to drain others just to keep myself alive? You don't think I would rather die than do this? I love you. When you stood by me that night, 
You gave me strength. You made me realize I had something to live for. That I wasn't just a wild animal. Balthasar, we need to turn him into the authorities. He belongs in jail. I know you don't want to do this. Trust me. I know what you're going through. But maybe you do have a choice in the matter. I can take you to the hospital. Maybe we can get you to visit someone who's in very old or close to death. Maybe there was someone in an accident and it's not possible for them to recover. Kara, no. Kara, please understand. If I drain someone who's old or gravely injured, it won't be enough. It has to be a healthy person. Besides, it's not like I'm hurting an innocent. If anything, I'm doing a public service, ridding the world of another criminal. I need to transform soon. And this is the final night I can perform the ritual for this year. It must be done. You! Kara. Do, do you know this man? I was 12. He. He. Kara. Kara, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I, I, I didn't know. I didn't know. I didn't know. Kara? You bastard! Do you remember what you did to me? I was 12! It's happening. Balthazar, sick him.
I can get used to this, Balthazar. Let me help you pick somebody out for next year.